Hello friends and welcome to AK Agrawal Aptitude Series. Friends, in this session we are going to learn a technique for solving a problem on probability. Here the given problem is in a class there are 15 boys and 10 girls. Three students are selected at random. The probability that one girl and two boys are selected is. Four options are given. So friends, to answer this question, first let us determine total number of possible events means total number of possible events means total 25 students are there 15 boys and 10 girls out of these 25 we have to select 3 so we can select number of ways selecting 3 students out of 25 is equal to 25 c3 because we have to select 3 out of 25 this is equal to 25 into 24 into 23 divided by 3 into 2 into 1 is equal to 2300 so there are different 2 3 2300 combinations are possible if we select 3 students from 25 but there is a condition out of these 3 one girl and two boys must be there so total number of favorable events is equal to number of ways selecting two boys and one girl so two boys we have to select out of 15 boys and one girl must be selected from 10 girls so two boys can be selected from 15 in 15 c2 multiplied by 10 c1 because we have to select one girl from the 10 girls multiplication sign is there because they are dependent on each other so 15 c2 is equal given by 15 into 14 divided by 2 into 1 and 10 c1 is given by 10 in divided by 1 this is equal to 1050 so 1050 are the total favorable events and 2300 are the total number of possible events so the required probability is given by number of favorable events divided by total number of possible events 1050 divided by 2300 if we simplify these two we get 21 upon 46 so answer is a 21 upon 46 Friends, if we slightly modify the same problem in a different way such that in a class there are 15 boys and 10 girls, 3 students are selected at random. The probability that all selected students are either boys or girls is, means these selected 3 students must be either boys or girls. Then what will be the probability? So first again, total number of possible events is equal to number of ways selecting 3 students out of 25 that is 25 c 3 is equal to 25 into 24 23 divided by 3 into 2 into 1 is equal to 2300 same way means we have to select 3 students out of 25 but what we want these 3 student must be boy or girls so number of ways selecting 3 boys if suppose those selected 3 students are 3 boys then how in how many ways we can select 3 boys out of 15 boys is equal to 15 c 3 is equal to 15 into 14 into 13 divided by 3 into 2 into 1 is equal to 455 so out of 15 boys 3 boys can be selected in 455 different ways now 10 girls and we have to select either this or number of ways selecting 3 girls out of 10 girls is equal to 10 c 3 is equal to 10 into 9 into 8 divided by 3 2 into 1 is equal to 120 so these two are mutually independent they are not dependent on each other either boys will be there or girls will be there so total number of favorable events will become 455 plus 120 is equal to 575 so total number of favorable events 575 total number of possible events 2300 so required probability is given by 575 number of favorable events divided by 2300 total possible events if we simplify this we get 23 upon 92 so answer is 23 upon 92 friends thank you very much for watching this video you can also follow me on facebook thank you